Hi, so je t'allais pour comme de ma chanel. This is your reading for the next month, January 2022. Let's see your first message. What we have for you? We have healing. Time for healing. You're not alone. You can see you could have some friend for you here. A message for Sagittarius. Action. And it's also time for you to take action in your life. Okay. Oops. Let's see your message. And so we have for Sagittarius. regards for your first week we have so eight of wands six of wands okay and you have come okay we have the king of wands you are going to have a lot of success and it's happening really fast for the first week let's see second week <clears throat> have the seven of wands lots of wands here five of cups high of hands okay you're protecting yourself with the five of cups you're not feeling good feeling sad <coughs> sorry and the high of hand, maybe it's time for you to meditate. The connection with the divine. Third week, cups of world. Two of cups. Queen of cups. Lots of emotion and love here. For the third week. And the fourth week. King of pentacles. Seven of pentacles. Judgment. Stability here for you. let's see mm. have the eight of wands for the first week the six of wands and the king of wands the eight of wands is talking about communication a lot of creativity and passion it's it's fascinating it's coming really fast for you let's see why is the eight of wands <coughs> we have the wheel it's a big change for you big change is coming for the first week of January it's about your success you are going to have success in your life because the six of wands she is successful because she's working a lot she this year is a success okay six of wands let's see it's lucky it's on your side for the first week yes you're working a lot, you can see it's the Knight of Pentacles. It's someone really focused on his job. Creating his own abundance, okay? It's you from the first week. And with the King of Wands, she's strong, powerful, and successful in business. Lots of passion. Be careful, it's also authority, okay? The king of pentacles, the king of wands, yes. Lots of power. Leo energy. Let's see. What's the king of wands here? Yeah. I'm the queen of swords. And she's very intelligent. Seeking the truth, protecting her heart here. It's also the queen. Very successful, a lot of success for you for the first week. I can see love for the first week. Really focus on your job. Mm, for the second weeks, you're defending. I'm sorry, you're defending yourself with the seven of wands.
okay? With the Five of Cups, it's like you're feeling sad. You're celebrating something, but you're not okay. Okay, a lot of sadness. Maybe it's time to take a break in your life with a higher fat. In this deck, it's about meditation. So Hylophan is a teacher, the teacher of life. You can learn or teach something for someone. Let's see, where is the seven of wands here? Nine of Knight of Swords. Knight of Swords it's someone really focused. Fast energy. Maybe too it's coming too fast. You need to slow down for the second week. Five of Cups, feeling sad. You're feeling sad because you kept waiting for something. With the three of Wands. But I feel like it's coming because just right here for the soul who comes the world, it's a happy ending for you. Second week, I really feel like you need to take care of yourself, slow down, everything will be okay. And kind of fun is high level commitment. Yes, yeah, because the ten of pentacles. Stability is coming for you in your life can have this turn of pentacle but you need to slow down because you are fully defending yourself protecting yourself slow down for the second week ten of pentacle it's abundance eh? happy family and stability for the third week it's a really good week i feel like some love is coming in your life we have the world two of cups and the queen of cups so cups are talking about emotion. The world is a happy ending. Success, love, joy. You're feeling good. It's the end of a cycle in your life. You can try something new after this moment. Uh, the two of cups, so beautiful connection. Mutual love soulmate connection you are feeling really good a lot of attraction between you two with the queen of cups it's a lot of emotion it's loving caring helping others in this deck she is pregnant let's see why is the world here yes you are going to have your success six of wands again okay so really good week for you the third week of January. Let's see, what is the two of cups? Mutual connection, lots of love. Four of Wands. The four of Wands is celebration. It's also a stable relationship. This card is talking about my age. Okay. And the Queen of Cups, let's see. Cups and Ten of Wands. The Ten of Wands is you with an heavy burden. But I feel like it's you because if you're alone, you have a lot of responsibility. You are taking care of your family, you are working a lot. Okay. But you can do it, Mila. You can. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> you have the King of Pentacles. The King of Pentacles is talking about stability. He is thinking a lot about his family first. It's a lot of abundant success. Let's see. I have the King of Pentacles. Come the end, man. Maybe you need to see with different perspective. Take a pause to see differently. Okay, you can find a solution in your life. You are taking action a lot for the next month. With the seven of pentacles, you like a pause. Okay, slow down. You can see your seeds are growing. Your good job is right here. With the seven of pentacles. Up 
suggest it's a big transformation for you for this uh, first week with the death card. We have a big transformation because we have judgment. Judgment, it's a judgment card. You are growing, learning about your past mistakes. It's a connection with your soul. You are free. You, you are free yourself. You are doing what you really want in your life. Let's see, where's judgment? Seven of Wands. Seven of Wands. It's you protecting your heart, protecting yourself after a fight, after lots of conflict in your life. I feel like because a lot of responsibility, you're very strong. Let's see. Three cards. Oops. Three cards for you. We have the dog, the sun, and the beer. The dog is talking about friendship or someone very. It's fidelity, loyalty, you can trust this person. I feel like it's a man in your life is coming because you have the beer. It's a new light. So the sun is talking about joy, happiness, a new light, a new direction for you in your life. With the desk card, I really feel like it's a new direction. And the beer is you need to be strong. It's your strength. Yes, also can be a, a boss, a family, someone very strong, powerful in your life. But I feel like it's you. Let's see. A message for the first week. For Sagittarius. First week, we got the Four of Swords. Time to rest. Okay, second week. Joy. Celebration for you for the second week. Okay. For the third week, we have struggle. Some struggle is like the ten of wands. Lots of responsibility. You can, uh, you can do it. It's maybe just on your mind because you have a lot of stabilities coming in your life. And for the fir first week, ten of cups joy, happiness, and a lot of love is coming for you with the Ten of Cups, happy family. Let's see, three cards. A Sagittarius, what do we have a Sagittarius for the next month? Three cards. You are going to have success. Yes, we have high honor for you for the next month. Your success is for the third week and for the first week. You are going to celebrate your success the third week. Be careful of your health. Take a break, slow down. We have bad help for you. Okay? It's just time for you to slow down because you're working a lot. And we have the house. The house is talking about your family, your stability. We have the Ten of Pentacles and the Ten of Cups. Everything will be okay in your family and you are going to have stability. Okay? Sagittarius, this is your reading for the next month. Thank you so much for watching and being here. Take care.